<laughs> Hello, Margo. How are you holding up? Um, Dr. Ronson, I've been getting a lot of messages, unsolicited messages from Ted. Oh, Margo, I'm sorry. With Liz gone, we've got no one to run interference with him. I'll talk to Ted. He mostly wants updates, constant updates, hundreds of updates on things he knows nothing about. Liz used to field all of his crap. He doesn't understand the systems at all. I was kind of by design. But he's getting pretty sketchy with me. We just have to keep him happy. Liz always said keep him happy. Are you kidding? You ever hear how she talked to him? <laughs> she was managing him, Margo. I mean, maybe I should ignore him. He's buried in his pyramid with the Hola Hola girls and Panta Antimon Cuckoos. What? What can he do? What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> Good. Bop. No. Keep that in the video. No. Ba. Ba. Like a sheep. Nothing else in here. Where are you supposed to go? Uh oh. <laughs> the door that was locked before. <laughs> Oh, power cell. Not sure. The future from Ted. What are we gonna plug into their heads, Les? A whole lot of history? A whole lot of so-called truth? A whole, a whole lot of noise? It's not pablum, Les. It's poison. <laughs> Is he okay? It? What is going is on he, with like, him? losing it? I think he is. Which is fair, because this is all his fault. So, If anybody's going to lose it, it should be him, right? <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. Coping with what he's fucking done? Killed everybody? <laughs> How would somebody even begin to cope with that? By helping to set it right. Yeah, but still... Not for everybody. Most people die. <laughs> There's another section at the back of the crater. Looks like it survived the blast. Because it was armored, you found the control room. I'm on my there? way. Oh, so we started down there. That's where the power cell was. Secret way, this way, or something. Here. Oh. Fall down there. This is going. Is he on like drugs or something? Did he make that transmission that's fucking everything up? Maybe. But why? I don't know me. 
Because all this is unnatural. No, not a bad. Above the power cell. What the hell? I didn't realize that it was going leading back up. Is there like a way up or something? Or just down. Okay, well I guess that's the way we leave or something. We need to guy up from it. Power cell? <laughs> no, no, let me through that door. Or not. Dead body? Maybe a little bit. Oh god. Oh, they all died like here. When I opened the hatch, the air rushed in from this side. Because there was none inside the chamber. Oh. But the alphas were in there. They suffocated to death in here? Can you go back? One second. Oh god, this is way more sinister than I thought it was gonna be. What? What happened? No power cell, just random fucking bullshit. Anyway, oh did they God. like decide to just all die in here or were they suffocated on accident? Or on purpose. But not all of them. Maybe. Maybe. Well, there was five of them. One, two, three, four, five. There's five of them here. Yeah. Maybe it was Ted. So actually, wait. I think this, they said in the first one that there was like 10 of them here. Oh yeah, there's, yeah, 11 including guys. Yeah. So. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven eight, eight, Elizabeth, and then one more. We're missing one, it seems. It does appear that way. Maybe it was that one extra uh, Did I get this one? I thought you did. One, two, three. One, two, three. Four, four five, five. Six, six seven, seven, eight. eight. Yeah, there's only eight. Maybe one of them did this to all the other ones. Maybe they went like stir crazy. Let's see. I'm locked out of core control. Alpha clearance overridden. What the hell is Omega clearance? Oh no. Alpha personnel. Sorry to alarm you, but I need you to listen, okay? To what I'm about to say. This isn't easy. See, uh, I've, uh, please, stop trying to access the system, okay? See, see what this is about is, um, I said, stop trying to access the goddamn system. And what, what I'm trying to say is, I can't stop thinking about the ones who come after us. Those innocents, those blameless men and, 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 and women. We're gonna give them knowledge? Like it's a gift? Ted, Ted, we've talked about this before. Apollo has 3,000 plus failsafe conditions. It's not a gift, it's a disease. They're the cure, and we're gonna give them the disease. 
Our disease? No. We can't. And it's not too late. If we're willing to sacrifice. Yes. It doesn't need to be like this. It already is, Samina. I did it three minutes ago. I've purged Apollo. It's gone. All of it. Every copy. A sacrifice? It's not a sacrifice. It's cultural obliteration, you crazy bastard. Millennia of culture. I'm sorry. Really, I am. But sometimes, to protect innocence, innocents have to die. Emergency alert. What? Just save what? his own skin because he didn't want them to all know that he killed them all. <laughs> Why do you even have access to that? <laughs> yeah. What the hell? That's so weird. Hi, silence. He killed them all. So this is why. This is why we were trapped in benighted ignorance mm -hmm. for an innocent future. Blameless men. <laughs> He never saw the slaughter in the sun ring. Everything these people achieved, all the knowledge of the old ones, evaporated, turned to dust, well, we still scattered the to the void, like the we? alphas themselves. No, not a void. When the hatch unsealed and scattered their ashes on the wind, it took them out among the world they made, the world we are living in. It's, it's a monument to what they died trying to accomplish. A monument to oblivion. Not oblivion, silence. Hope. That's so fucked. I wonder how long after they got here this was. It couldn't have been long. Got it. Mr. Override. Oh. Now all you have to do is kill Hades with it. Why'd you pull your phone off? Turn to silence workshop. Okay. Yes, no second power cell for you. Wow. Everybody here. Dead like that. Is that good? Uh, uh, Try not to fall to your death. The master override doesn't override gravity. Keep holding, keep holding. You're fine, Aloy. Get all the collectibles. That's all oh. the holograms. Just missing the first one over here. <laughs> Wait, what? No idea where that was. It had to be somewhere you went early, really early. <laughs> or maybe it's like the one in the power cell room? Maybe? Because you could get there really early. I don't know. They have a weird order in this, I feel like. <laughs> I think Ted killed everyone in Elysium too? <clears throat> Probably not. Uh, you're oh, he is here. here. What the hell? For a moment. What? Our journey together has come to an end, what Aloy. Mean? But before I go. I think I owe it to you to tell you the rest of the story. Go on. Some time ago, I admitted that I'd been involved with the Eclipse. But I never told you the full extent of my culpability. The truth is, I was there at the beginning. I found Hades Aloy, buried on that mountain, trapped in that shattered titan. And I served it. What? 
It promised knowledge and delivered such knowledge you have no idea. And in exchange? I helped create the Eclipse. Helped it build a cult, an army to do its will. Why are you telling me this now? Because your success depends on knowing this. When I found Hades, the first thing it wanted to know about was the Spire. Not Meridian. The Spire. Now why would that be? The Spire was created Minerva. by Gaia. Mm -hmm. Which part of Gaia? Minerva. M Minerva. Mm -hmm. It's code-breaking module. Gaia built spires to transmit the codes that deactivated the Pharaoh robots, shut down their biomatter conversion systems. Hades wants to send a new transmission to wake the machines so they can devour the world all over Hades again. Pharaoh. Yes. Based on what we've learned, that's my conclusion as well. So the Eclipse, the robots they've resurrected, they're just a means to an end. An army to me. capture the Spire. Yes. So Hades can exterminate life all over again. Unless you stop it. Tell me everything about yeah. you and Hades. I want you to tell me everything. Hades, the Eclipse. Everything. It's a long story, Eloy. Okay. Then get a... started. It began with a focus. Recovered from an ancient ruin, as yours was so many years ago. In my case, the device was heavily damaged. There was just a flicker of life in it. I spent weeks studying it, attempting repairs, until finally, I succeeded. A whole new dimension of perception revealed, right before my eyes. That's when I detected it. A faint signal. Out there, something was searching, just like I was. A real kindred spirit. I followed the signal to its source. A shattered titan, buried in the jungles of the Jew. Hades? So you thought it was a titan? An old war machine? I didn't know what to think. I'd seen such wreckage before. The Grave Horde, for example. But this was different. This was not quite dead. It couldn't speak when I found it, until my repairs gave it a voice. So began an exchange of knowledge. It wanted to know everything about our world, its tribes and machines. But the Spire was always its foremost concern. I wonder if this was before or after the explosion. Would have been uh, would have been after. Yeah. This would have just been a few years back now, wouldn't it? Yeah, I would think so. Because if Helis said he found, well, he, I guess he was part of finding it right after Meridian was taken back mm -hmm. from Drone. So, yeah. What did it want to know about the spire? Its precise location, the surrounding geography. Who controlled the land? Meanwhile, Hades revealed to me many of the intricacies of ancient technology. It bid me to recover and repair more focuses. Oh, that's how he knew. Before long, I had a couple dozen up and running. Enough to equip a small army. The commanders of one, anyway. I didn't care. I was learning so much. Physics, calculus. You have no idea. Why, the Karja. And the Shadow Karja? How did they become involved? The Karja Civil War was a happy coincidence. A perfect opportunity. <laughs> An opportunity? That's what it was to you? Yes. He's trying to make it right. Overnight, half the tribe was in exile, desperate to win back Holy Meridian. Their religion made them easy to manipulate. All I had to do was present Hades as the buried shadow of their mythology. So yes, it was an opportunity. I arranged for High Priest Bahavas to meet with Hades. Helis was there as well. Okay, so... And so the Eclipse was born. Anything to win back Holy Meridian. So how long has Hades been activated? 
Neither of you cared about Meridian. But Hades didn't care about Meridian. And neither did you. We live in a world of fallen cities and vanished tribes. What were a few more? Besides, I was too busy setting up the cult's focus network to Hades' specifications. <laughs> a thrilling technical challenge, especially with the alterations I included of my own design. The ability for you to spy on them. Yes. I may have been foolish enough to serve Hades, but I was never so foolish that I trusted it. I installed what the ancients used to call a back door in the network. Secret access, empowering me to monitor all activity and communications. Why did you betray them? What made you turn on Hades? It certainly wasn't your conscience. Maybe Actually, I was troubled the first time I saw the Eclipse raise an ancient war robot. With my technology. I questioned Hades about its intentions. A little late? Indeed. I'd already outlived my usefulness. When I completed work on the Focus Network, Hades summoned me to receive my reward. The next moment, I heard it broadcast my kill order. <laughs> what? I've been a fugitive ever since. Interesting. So, the transmission has to be like a Pharaoh Plague transmission that corrupted Hades. Yeah. Because how else would Hades be able to like control the Pharaoh robots and mm -hmm. want to know about the spire? So when did I come into this? Our path together? When Olin stumbled on you. System threat detected. That got my attention. A kill order against a savage Nora girl. Why would Hades bother with that? But then I saw that this Nora girl was wearing a focus and bore an uncanny resemblance to a great scientist of the old world. <laughs> Helis moved quickly. I thought you were dead. But then I detected your focus inside the Nora mountain. The more I observed you, the more convinced I became of your extraordinary nature and usefulness. Through you, I could finally discover the secrets of the Earth. I vowed to do everything I could to ensure your success. The rest, as they used to say, is history. There's nothing you want to do for knowledge. You've done what you could to me. Yeah, you've done what you could. Yeah. He's tried us. He's helped us. Yeah. Silence. You've done terrible things, Silence. But yeah. you've also done what you could to undo them. I can't say you've balanced the scale, but at least you've tried. To be clear, Aloy, I would do it all again. A few more safeguards, perhaps, but basically the same. Really? So much for learning from mistakes. I've done all I can. From here on out, the rest is up to you. What have you done? Take my lance. Fit the master override to it, and you have a means of injection. What? Then I just need to get close enough to Hades' skull to stab it in? Exactly. Oh, no problem. <laughs> Silence! <laughs> Where will you go? West. Elsewhere. And everywhere. There's so much more to discover before the world ends. And all this? I leave it to you, of course. As it turned out, it was yours all along. I was merely trespassing. Okay, bye, silence. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh my god. <laughs> Are these. Silence logs? Looks like it. What I got? First. first meeting. I traveled far to find you. I heard your transmission. It was you, wasn't it? Entity is not known. I'm called Silence. And you are. I don't think you'd have called out if it wasn't something you wanted. You called, I responded. Will you tell me your name? Hades. 
Jeez. You are a creation of the ancients. A war machine? Define timeline. Time? Ah. It is the 13th king of the Kaja Sultan's reign. Define Kaja. We're getting ahead of ourselves. Were you created by the ancients? I wonder how long you waited here, buried, until I chanced upon you. How long you'd have to wait for another. You're obviously very powerful. But you're not going to get anywhere without me. Titan Frame merely houses intellect. Define Karja. Now that's more like it. Yeah. It's just usually it as host. But how to get in there? I need to get in there once the little blast went off. Oh yeah, that's when it would have gone rogue with the yeah. pharaoh shit. What's this? That's... Task is complete. Yes. The focus network is active, built to your specifications. Check it yourself if you must. I would. But... I remind you of the reward you've been withholding. Quantum processing? Data has been compiled. Volume too great for transfer. How inconvenient for me. Come before me. You shall receive your reward. Very well. Helis. Threat detected inside Eclipse. Speak its name, O Shadow, and it will die. You will eliminate this one. Silence. Silence. Yes. A truth whispered at night is seen in the day. He was never one of us. It will be done. Hmm. Okay, yeah, Great shot. They're coming. Reparations are complete. Ah, loosen to Bahamas. Behold, as I promised you. What? Manner of great machine is this? I've never seen such a thing. Stay! Stay your ground, Karcha in shadow! Incorrect. Bow before the buried shadow. The buried shadow? I... I don't understand. Did Araman understand the Glint Hawk that perched upon the Alight? <laughs> it speaks scripture. Araman followed the shadow cast from the spire. To the Mesa, where Holy Meridian was founded. You will follow the shadow once more. I am a righteous man, chosen of the sun. But in times of need, the powers of shadow can accomplish what the sun alone cannot. Will, will you return to us what is ours, O oh, shadow of prophecy? An army is required. Obey, and Meridian is yours. Of our obedience, you can be certain. <laughs> Fucking idiots. <laughs> mm -hmm. Fucking tricked them. Okay. New, new spear? Covered a powerful weapon. Is that our melee weapon now? Obtain Silence Lance. I don't know. Let's see. It is. Oh, oh it my looks God. fucking cool. Holy shit. The looming shadow goes to the Palace of the Sun. Cool. I have to tell Avad that the Eclipse are ready to strike. After what happened with Durval, I know he'll defend the city. Fire. Now I got a skill point, so you can get one of those. And look at your inventory. Still no powers. Just start here. I wonder. Silence lands. Oh, let's see. Wait, what? Where's your spear? Because your spear is gone now. Yeah. Slow. 
Heavy shock attack. Whoa, look at its stats. 50, 50. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh my oh, god, oh. that's cool. That's so cool. <laughs> oh my god, you're a badass now. <laughs> Epic new spear. Let's go. Can you put a mod on it yet? Hmm. Oh, no. No. <laughs> oh. oh, now they're ready. You didn't get Hades yet. <laughs> oh, they're gonna be backwards a little bit at a time. It seems like because only one of them says that it's prepared. Okay, so this is uh, November 1964. Uh, just just wrapped inspection of Gaia Prime site. Construction is well underway. Reactor installed. Plan for control room remind. Plans for control room remind me of Starship bridges on those cheesy old SF vids. Uh, living spaces for Alpha is already completed. Prefab modules. Fingers crossed. We never have to seal ourselves in here. Not that Elysium sounds much better. Uh, spent last week on the Bryce side designing ZD project labs, uh, drawing up protocols. The base where repurposing was huge, plenty of room for workspaces and reside blocks. The work crews already set up my office slash lab. I'm not a fan of the glass wall. I guess Murray's intention was to en ensconce me as all-seeing presence. Uh, opposite effect makes me feel watched on display, tempted to paint it over. Harris recorded his presentation yesterday, suitably bleak, scheduled to record mine Friday. Soon as reception, lounge, hall of theaters, and first residence block at Zero Dawn site are finished, we'll start processing the candidates being held inside Tucson. 27 already. Extraction teams prioritize PAC, RIM, and Aussie candidates. How scared and confused they must be snatched off the streets, carted across the world, held in cells. Here's hoping they understand once they see the big picture. Going to catch a few hours of sleep here, then fly back to the Zero Dawn site. Harris promised delivery of QB lattices by noon. Expect MK1 will take two weeks to machine, assemble, and test. I aim to launch Gaia at 0.6 T grounding. From there, I'll spin her up past 1.0 T. Wonder how long it'll take to break the 1.38 T record. MIE can go hang sleep. What am I missing? Oh my god, that was all of the audio data points. Yeah, it was. All of them. Good job. And all of the hologram data points. Mm -hmm. I'm just missing a few. We got some damaged ones and a few ones I don't have in the very first one. And then a ton of texting ones. <laughs> that. Okay, I'll get this next, I guess. Okay, well, uh, I'm gonna. Uh, travel to here. Well, I guess goodbye, silence. Mm -hmm. mm, that kind of sucks. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, he's not, I guess, indifferent. Yeah, I don't think he's really supposed to be a likable or dislikable character, really. Okay, well, we're gonna end that one there. Obviously. Looks like this recording actually works, so hopefully I can splice all those together fine. Um. Yeah. Um, so next time we'll be going to Meridian and finally seeing the Spire mm -hmm. over here. Hopefully there's a power cell. Mm -hmm. um, we'll also be able to stop by this dude here for uh, our uh, stranded shit. Yeah, that's exciting. So yeah. We are 97.5. So close. And we are almost there. Yeah, I can't really think of anywhere else that we could go. We've been in the mountain. It's just the spire, and I don't know. Maybe, maybe this is like the the Hades boss fight arena here. I don't know. Yeah. Maybe. I can't imagine us going all the way back to the jewel. To... No. Can he leave there? <laughs> I don't. Think, I don't know. I don't know. Uh, but yeah, we'll see y'all in the next episode. Bye. Bye.